Hey guys, my name's Jamin. This is my YouTube channel, PC Monkey, where I try to bring you a wide variety of do-it-yourself computer upgrade and repair videos. The computer I have with me now is a Lenovo Yoga 11E Chromebook. In this video, I'll show you how to access and replace your battery and your Wi-Fi card. As always, guys, if you have any questions, please check out the FAQs below in the description first. It could save you some time getting an answer. If you don't see your question there, you need to leave me a question or comment. Please do. I try to get to those at least a couple times a day. Okay, so the first thing to do before getting into any computer, we're gonna turn it off. We're gonna make sure that it's unplugged. We want as little power running through the computer as possible uh, to limit the chances of damaging anything. The next thing you do when taking apart a computer is take out your battery. In this case, the battery is inside the computer. So we'll have to remove this panel and get into the computer to get at the battery. As you can see, the computer is also sitting on an anti-static pad. Um, either an anti-static pad or an anti-static bracelet is a good idea to also limit the chances of damaging any of your components. As a reminder guys, if you need any help finding any equipment or tools that I use in my videos, there'll be a link up here. I'll also include the link down bottom in the description. I'll help you out finding that stuff if you need it. So to get inside this computer now, we have four screws up here on the bottom case. And we have one, two, three, four, five, six screws on the panel. There are also two screws here, one of which you can see, the other one you can see it um, how you're most likely gonna see it. It's got some black tape covering it uh, to try to hide it. So we're gonna go ahead now and remove all these screws with our screwdriver. Another tip guys, make sure when you're going into any computer that you keep the screws separate from each other. Not all screws are the same size. Screws to different components may be different lengths and different widths. So make sure that you keep the screws separate when you go to put your computer back together. So when I was new at computer repair, one of the tricks I did is I wrote out sticky notes for each component that had screws, bottom case, keyboard, things like that. And I'd make sure to keep the screws that went to the bottom case here so that when I was putting the computer back together, I didn't use the wrong screws for the wrong item. To get this piece of rubber out, I'll take a small flathead screwdriver and I'll just stab it right down in there Pry it out, try not to damage it too much. These are usually just held in with double-sided tape. They'll pop back in as long as you don't damage them too much. Okay, so after taking up all those screws, we're gonna take our flat pry tool. We're gonna go across the seam and pick it up. And you may find that some screws are still screwed down a little bit. There we go and that comes off like that. So here now you have access to your battery and your Wi-Fi card. I'll zoom in so you can see the battery better. So your battery, it looks like, is held in by these two screws uh, and then just a plug. So to take your battery out, we're just gonna remove these two screws. So the battery plug is just a straight plug. It's just pushed straight in. There's no pins or clips or anything holding it. So lift the battery up a little bit, we'll take it out and then we'll pull back on that plug and it should come right out like that. For those of you looking for a part number, you'll see a couple here, 45N1750 or 45N1751. That's a standard Lenovo part number, and that's what you would search for to find compatible batteries. Whether you want a brand name Lenovo or whether you want a, a, a generic, it'll have that part number. To remove your Wi-Fi card, this is pretty standard. The Wi-Fi card is held in by one screw and two antenna wire. We're gonna take our plastic pry tool we're gonna pop up the antenna wires. They come up fairly easily. Now to undo the Wi-Fi card, that screw is actually a hex screw. So you may have trouble getting it out with the same screwdriver you used earlier, but the hex screw will come out and the Wi-Fi card will just pop up and then you slide it out. Just like your battery, there's a Lenovo part number you can find on the Wi-Fi card if you're looking for a replacement. It's small, but it says 04W. 6059, that's the part number assigned to this. Also, the model of Wi-Fi card is 7260NGW. Uh, both of those numbers can help you track down a compatible Wi-Fi card if you're looking for a replacement. Okay, so that's our video. Pretty simple operation if you know what you're getting into, if you have the right tools. Uh, again, if you have any questions, check out the FAQs. If you need to leave me a question or comment, please do so. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I look forward to seeing you on my next video.